So now he already has a putting stroke. Yeah. The only thing you need to do with that putting stroke now is practice rolling the ball into pictures. Okay. So if let's say you and I are playing softball. Okay. Here's your softball. Yeah. Stand right there. So if you wanted to toss that ball into my hand, let it fall very softly into my hand here. Awesome. Did you have to think about how far? No, just had a picture of the target and know where to go. Exactly. So he saw the picture and just reacted to the picture. Yeah. So now this time, what I want you to do is throw it straight into my microphone here. Okay. Go ahead. Look at that. Yeah. So notice there was a little more pace on it. Yeah. But you didn't have to think about it. Yeah. As soon as you had that picture, yeah. you knew what to do with it. So this is what I gave Savannah as an exercise, and this is what she does when she's working on her putting, and this is something that you can do at home in your living room. So you put a little strip of carpet on your, your little putting green, right? An edge of a carpet right there. So the first one, you know, what I like to do is roll the ball and just nudge the edge of the carpet. Okay. So you let it hang, mm -hmm. bring it in. Yes, that fits, okay. Now, the last two feet of the putting surface prior to that edge of the carpet, I'm gonna see the ball rolling very slowly and just nudge the edge. Okay. So there's the picture I saw. Okay. So, see the ball roll slowly and nudge the edge. Bonk. See that? Yeah. The next one, I'm gonna see the ball roll a little bit faster pop over the edge and stop on the edge, on top of the edge. So I feel the weight of the putter. That fits. See the ball roll and pop up. Right over the edge. Next one, see that one? Yeah. I'm going to bump the ball and make it just touch the edge. Okay. So, and this is where you can start having fun with your alignment. This is hanging. Yeah. This feels like the momentum wants to go way too far left. Okay. A little less left, still too far left. A little less left, still too far left. Ooh, feels like I'm hitting the ball now. So I feel the momentum want to go in that direction. See the ball roll smoothly into that ball and nudge it. And there you have it. There you go. So I just picture what I'd like to see the ball do yeah. And it's the last two, three feet of the speed that I'm seeing the ball roll okay. is that's Picture. what feeds into. That's yeah. that yeah. drop it softly in my hand versus toss it aggressively into my chest. Okay. So you're now reacting to a picture mm -hmm. with momentum. Right. If you have to stick handle it and place it, mm -hmm. then you can't use momentum. You can't hold a picture out of that. If you can't use momentum, you don't have touch. Yeah. Okay. okay you already have okay. that God-given gift of touch. Okay. This is how we use it. So if your arm putter unit is in balance below your shoulders, yeah. now you have the ability to use the weight of the arms and club, yeah. and you stop becoming a manipulator, right. and then you now have that nice free-flowing stroke. Right. Then all you have to do is picture how you'd like to see the ball roll in. Yeah. Do you want to see it like if on a, on a very fast downhill putt, you're gonna see that ball in the last two, three feet roll very slowly and follow the front of the hole into the bottom yeah. versus a slow you know, putt on a shaggy green. Yeah. So now you're gonna do a failed Evil Knievel attempt. You know who Evil Knievel is, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. okay, see it? Yeah, I'm up to date. <laughs> okay, so you'll see the ball go off the front and hit the back of the hole as it goes down into the hole. You don't wanna see it hit the back of the hole at the top of the hole and pop out. Yeah you wanna see the ball hit the back of the hole on the way in. So that gives you that speed control. Right. Now, because of today, we're dealing with flag sticks. They yeah. just changed the rules so you can leave the flag stick in. Yeah. So how gently do you wanna nudge the flag stick? Right, so that gives you a good picture. Exactly, so on, a, so on that, that uphill putt, you wanna yeah. see it you know, hit the flag stick with a nice little pop. Yeah. And on a tricky downhill hole, you wanna see it just tip and just, and just follow the flag stick and the, and the side of the hole into the bottom. Right. Yeah. Pretty cool, huh? Yeah, that's cool. All right, so let's see you do a couple. Okay. So, same thing here. Okay. Get your setup. You want your arm putter unit hanging from your shoulders. Okay, the, so is, is your putter in the center of the feet? 
So for as far as your ball position, you guys, yeah. when the putter hangs, that's, the ball should be right in front of that. Okay. So, so back away from the ball, let the, the swing, swing the putter back and through, feel where it wants to track. So does that feel like it's hanging from the shoulders? Yeah, right here. Okay, so let the putter hang wherever it wants to hang there from your shoulders, in the air. Okay. Right there, right? Well, let it hang. Okay. Right there, perfect. So then you'd have the ball in front of that. So if I want to dock myself to the ball, let's say I'm over here, yeah. and I want the ball to be in front of my putter face. Well, I'm going to have to go this way, mm -hmm. and then go over here. And I just docked myself with the ball. All right. See how that works? Yeah. Good. So now, eyes here. See the ball roll slowly to it and just let it kiss the edge. Okay. Good. That's all right. So this is what's cool. Yeah. Now your brain has a reference. It yeah. says, oh, with that much momentum, it pops over the edge. Let's see you do it again. That's it. There's nothing to fix. Nice. Yeah, see that? Yeah. So it's like when you play darts, yeah. I want the bullseye. Didn't get the bullseye. I missed it a little left. Okay, next, next dart, yeah. bullseye. Oh, there's the bullseye. Right. Okay. It takes a little, a little bit of recalibration. That's it. Yeah. There's nothing to think about. So now, well, we got that ball right here now. Yeah. So let's see you just nudge the ball up against the strip now. So in the last couple of feet, you're, you're seeing the ball roll slowly and nudge that ball into the strip. So now, do you feel like you're lined up? Right Let me see you line up way too far right. Far right. Way too far right. Okay. So that would be way too far left. Let's see way too far right. Too far right. The other right. Like this, this right? <laughs> Aim that way too much. Okay. Way too much. Way too much? Way too much. No, no. More. Keep coming. Yeah, yeah. More. More. Good. Okay. More. So this is giving you a reference. Yeah. So if you're not sure how to, you know, if you're lined up or not, mm -hmm. you've got to give yourself uh, a very clear reference. All right, yeah. So what would be way too far right? So as soon as that, you feel that that's way too far right, yeah. now go a little less right and just keep nudging back until you feel that, that it evaporates and you feel like you're on the ball. Yeah, right here. Right there? Yeah. So everything hanging or are you reaching? I'm reaching. So I got to move a bit. There you go, man. Good. So now look at the last couple of feet rolling into it and let momentum roll it in there. Not bad. Now, did you guide that? I kind of did, yeah. Kind of? Yeah, okay. I did. Yeah, I did. Was on so it's hanging. There we go. Good. So now once you're set, yeah. it's out of your control. You're just going to let momentum roll the ball into that picture. Nice. Okay. Yeah. Let's do it again. So, yeah. Take your time to adjust with it, work with it. Exactly. So, for, if for all you guys, you know, if, if this is a putt to break 80 or yeah. a putt to break 100 and, and it means a lot to you, yeah. if you try to make sure mm -hmm. you'll stick handle it, yeah. you're going to guide it, you're going to manipulate it, and you're going to miss that putt, chances are you're going to missed the putt. Yeah. So once you're set and the arms are hanging from the shoulders and you feel like, hey, if I let the weight of my arm putter unit roll the ball in that direction, yeah. does it feel yeah. like it wants to hit that ball? Answer is yes. So I've done my job, man. Yeah. Right? Yeah. So there's nothing for me to do. So now all I'm going to do is see the ball roll in and nudge it and then let momentum take care of it. See that? Yeah. So that wasn't me hitting that ball. That was momentum. That was the weight of my arms and putter mm -hmm. being allowed to ride their own arc. Okay. So they're riding right there. So since they're in balance, this is where they want to go, and I'm going to allow them to. I won't, I won't stick it. I won't take the control away from gravity. Okay. okay? Let's see that again. So let's see you go between these two here. How about that? Right there. You should be pretty lined up. Very good. Right on, Moo. So you had the line. Yeah, but the 
did you did you look at the last two feet and did you see a ball rolling up against the the the, the tape? Um, no, I just met. I just thought about just getting it there. But right. Not, but not thinking about. How so I so to get here's there. this is important. Okay. What Mo just did there mm -hmm. is you hit a safe putt. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So let's say the edge of that tape, that was the edge of a cliff. Right. Would you walk to the edge of a cliff like this? No. You you're gonna to you're gonna you're gonna tiptoe over to it, right? You're gonna right. stop yeah. and be short because yeah. that's safe. You're yeah. not gonna fall off, yeah. and then you kind of tiptoe to the edge until you see what's going on. Yeah. So you see that edge, yeah. but you don't see a ball rolling up and nudging the edge. This is the cherry on the Sunday for our lesson. Okay. So you must always take the time to see the ball roll into the hole yeah. the way you want it to roll in or roll up to the edge yeah. the way you want it to roll. Not, not tiptoe it through. Right, <laughs> exactly. None of this happy Gilmore tap tap. <laughs> Beautiful. Well done. All right. Now, you put your eyes short. Okay. See the ball roll up to the edge and nudge the edge. Look at that. Perfect. Yeah. See, did you guys see the difference? Yeah, that is difference. That's exactly how it works. Yeah. So if you're short and you go, you know, most people will go, oh, that, that pace is just perfect. And then, yeah. and then the ball ends up this far short and you go, oh. Yeah. And then sometimes you hit a putt and the ball is you know, screaming toward the hole. You go, oh my God, that's way too far. Yeah. And the ball rolls in at the right pace. And you're going, oh, oh I got scared for nothing. Yeah. Nice putt. Yeah. So this is why. Yeah, you got to see the picture. Exactly. It's important to see the picture. So if, you, if the edge of the cliff is, you know, you look over the edge, it's only a foot down. You say, oh, it's not a problem, you know? Yeah. Versus, oh crap, that's, uh, that looks like 300 feet down. I'm out of here, yeah. right? Yeah. So... That's, in a nutshell, how you putt properly. Okay. Do you think you can do that? Yeah, I can do that now. So while I do some more videos over there, I'll let you practice over here. Yeah, thanks so much. Thanks a lot, Moo. No problem. All right. All the best, you guys.